So I was asked if there's a way to remove chromatic aberration in the iPad version of Affinity Photo. So that's what this video will be. So chromatic aberration, which is just this purple fringing along the edges of the tree, is basically a failure of the lens to focus all the colours to the same point. And it can happen for a few different reasons, but one of them is when there's a lot of contrast. So the dark edges of the trees against the white of the sky has then caused this purple. So there's two ways you can remove it. The first one is the destructive way, which just means once you've done it, you can't change it again. You can only undo it. So to do that, you want to go to the develop persona and then go to the lens studio, which is the second one down. And then you can turn on chromatic aberration and see if that helps which it hasn't, so then I'm going to turn on defringing which has helped a lot but then there's still some purple in the corners so then this is the colour here which you can adjust to match the fringe and that will help remove it so since this has got a bit more of a red tone I'm going to move it slightly over to the right and that will start getting rid of it and then there's these different options that you can mess around with so I'm going to bring the tolerance up all the way and the radius and now you can see that's got rid of it so that's the first way of doing it I'm just going to cancel that and um, the second way is a non-destructive way which means you can go back and change it so you're going to go over to the filter studio then go to colors and then add live filter and then you've got defringe and then you can see you've still got all the same options so I'm just going to adjust the colour. And I don't really need to adjust these ones as that's removed it. But sometimes, and it's not really happened in this picture, but you might get two colours. So you might have purple on one side and green on the other side. So by doing it this way, you can then add another defringe filter and then you can adjust that one to the green or the other colour to remove both of them.